So nobody has successfully observed influenza transmission under controlled conditions. It has never been done. And that is part of the big problem with understanding how flu is transmitted. Until we can observe transmission and see how it really happened in real time, we don't know for sure how it works. So we would like to find people who are just beginning to get the flu. Now, you know, the classic flu is that you went to work and you felt fine. And at 1.30 in the afternoon, it hit you. You just suddenly started feeling chilly and your throat started getting scratchy and you started coughing. Call us right there. That's when we want to get you, because that's when you're most infectious. I hope that we clearly define how flu is transmitted between people, influenza virus, and that that allows us to set better public health policy. And uh, if it turns out, as I hypothesize, that it's mainly by breathing air contaminated with viruses, that that will help us motivate policy change, uh, improvement in air quality in public places, in schools, in uh, religious meeting houses, and in homes.